beauties, welcome to Goddess Bell. Thank you so much for being here with me and Sheila Caterine. And today's video, I want to share with you a natural hair treatment with oils and essential oils that I'm going to apply on my hair. Okay? So, uh, today is my, I don't remember what day of my hair. By the way, I hope you have a beautiful hair day. A great hair day because every day is a beautiful hair day no matter what even if you wake up with your hair really like doing whatever he wants <laughs> no matter okay your hair is beautiful because it's your crown like you you are a goddess you are gorgeous you are beautiful and your hair too because it's the crown of the goddess you see hello so okay so uh, today is my, I don't remember what day hair. I know I have more than two weeks without washing my hair. And the only thing, uh, the only thing that I have on my hair is a natural flaxseed gel. That's it. Okay, so today I'm going to apply a uh, oil treatment on my hair. And I want to show you and explain to you the right way to apply oils on your hair. It's not just take the oil and apply it on your hair like crazy and like saturate your hair of oils. It's not like that because at the end you're going to lose a lot of hair, okay? So always less is more. Always. Okay? So, this is my hair. My hair is feeling super, super soft. After a hair treatment with orange, if you want to do that treatment or if you want to know the process and the ingredients, I will leave in the comments below a, the link of that treatment, okay? It's for all hair types. But uh, today, seriously, my hair feels like baby hair. My God, nice. I grew up looking at my grandma applying oils on her hair. Her hair is beautiful. She's 94 years old and for me she's my biggest inspiration in life. She's a real goddess, for real. And she loves her hair, for real. I grew up looking at her, how she was taking care of her hair using only natural ingredients. And she was always using oils. So her favorite oil was almond oil and jojoba oil. But I, always she had in her uh, home in her room, um, almond oil, always, no matter what she had, always, or she has, because she's still alive, thanks God, my God, uh, almond oil, okay, but I don't have almond oil, so my treatment today will be with avocado oil, okay, avocado oil is amazing for all hair types, okay, so this is avocado oil for, for the kitchen to cook, why if you can get a avocado oil for hair because those oils for hair care has most of the time perfumes and other ingredients that i don't want on my hair okay but avocado oils like the oils that you can eat is the most natural and pure okay so my hair is natural your hair is beautiful and natural so your hair needs something really natural and clean okay so if i want avocado oil on my hair i just want avocado oil no other ingredient that's why okay so with this oil avocado oil you can cook you can fry you can do whatever you want because this oil is the best for your hair and for your kitchen to eat so that's why I will be using this oil, avocado oil from Refinade, cold press and organic, okay? You, of course you can use jojoba oil, olive oil, stay away from coconut oil because you need to rinse it out and clean your hair so well and put it like a good uh, shampoo. So why I'm gonna apply something so good and then I have to like shampoo my hair even three times to remove all those oils is not good, you know, because then your hair will be super dry. So that's why I prefer this oil, okay? Avocado oil. Uh, so I will be applying the avocado oil from here to the tips of my hair. And for my scalp, because I feel like itchy, because the weather is like cold, it's hot, it's cold, it's hot in Florida. So it's like, I'm in Florida, so it's like sometimes it's cold and sometimes it's super hot so my scalp my skin is like not feeling well 
so I'm feeling like itchy on my scalp so I will be applying mixing jojoba oil organic jojoba oil and tea tree oil okay so this is a essential oil tea tree oil lemon oil these essential oils you have to mix it with something like jojoba oil like avocado oil like olive oil grape seed uh, oil but I never never just applying the essential oil or oil on your scalp and that's it because this can this can burn your skin okay you don't want an irritation on your skin because this is a skin it's very 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 sensitive so I will be mixing these two beautiful ones and then I will apply it on my scalp as a scalp treatment yes today is my day woohoo God is day yeah Seriously, I love to take care of my hair. Like when I'm feeling like it's a shitty day or something like that, or like a lot of stress, I'm just like, you know what? I'm gonna do something on my head, and this makes me feel like released like, oh, and peace because I'm getting like energy, taking care of myself, like having a connection with my hair. Okay, but whatever. So, yeah, so I will be using these three beauties on my hair for today. Okay, so. Okay, now I'm gonna start applying the hair treatment on my bell. So this is my hair. It's feeling pretty soft uh, with more than two weeks without wash. And now I'm gonna separate my hair uh, using these hair clips or hair ties, whatever you have at home. And I will be using these uh, easy applicator bottles now I have to session off my hair and I'm gonna start applying the avocado oil only on the length of my hair so I'm passing the oil on the bottle and then I'm gonna apply some oil on my hands and rub the oils on my on my hands to make it warm because I prefer to do this step than putting the oil on the heat because the heat can kill the benefits of the oil okay so always natural natural way is the best so I'm applying the oil without touching the my scalp and uh, focusing uh, applying the oil focusing on the on my hair tips on the end of my hair because it's the older hair that we have, okay? And I don't want split ends and things like that. And I'm using the oil to, to um, separate my hair and make it soft, uh, detangling my hair with my fingers is the best way, okay? So you're gonna avoid breakage and damage. When your hair is healthy, if you're not using heat or any junk products, your hair will seriously look amazing only with water or even with the oil. It's super easy to detangle your hair or your hair is going to keep the natural texture. If you have curly hair, it's going to be super curly without applying a bunch of products. So seriously i know we we are sometimes busy but uh, taking the time to take care of yourself and your hair is amazing is 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 the best it's the best and you're gonna have beautiful results so now i'm applying uh, again the oil on my hair the avocado oil and you can see my hair texture is looking it's looking good it's looking healthy and i'm doing the same and i'm almost done with this uh, part of my head and then i will do the same process and the other side of my hair i love to use this oil as a pre poo or oil hair treatment not to seal my hair after I wash it and it's so nice and clean okay because this this oil is not to leave your on the hair for days okay so doing this treatment this process that I'm showing you is the best way to use the avocado oil no matter what type of hair texture you have if you don't want to have build up and bunch of dust on your hair 
Next step, I will be mixing 20 drops of essential tea tree oil and jojoba oil. So if you don't have jojoba oil, you can use olive oil, but um, my favorite one is jojoba oil. And now I'm applying these oils on my scalp, focusing where I'm feeling like I have irritation. And then I'm applying all the oil around my scalp and on the baby hairs because I want the, those baby hairs to grow stronger and beautiful, healthier. Okay, now I'm making some pressure on my scalp with the oils and a three minutes massage on my scalp. Very, very gentle, okay? Very, very gentle and the same direction with my fingertips. ready my hair and I'm gonna leave this treatment for around 30 to 45 minutes 45 minutes is enough don't leave those oils for days on your scalp because then you're gonna have really bad results losing a lot of hair so this is the hair that I lost detangling my hair looks like it's a lot but now my hair is long so that's why that's why um, I don't like to throw my hair uh, like it's garbage, no. I always save my hair and then I like to go in nature and plant my hair. So, okay, next step, I have warm water, no hot water, warm water, and this is a cotton t-shirt, and I'm gonna soak the t-shirt and the water inside the water and then I will put this t-shirt on my head, okay? Be careful, you don't need to put it like super hot you don't want to burn your skin okay you don't want to burn yourself so uh, just when it's warm to 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 open the cuticles of your hair and make you feel relaxed because it's 45 minutes that you're gonna have those oils on your hair or at least 30 minutes so in that time you can do something for yourself I don't know read a book watch my videos here on YouTube make a salad drink a cow like do something nice for yourself or I don't know whatever you want to do but it's like 34 to 45 minutes and then okay you you should rinse your hair or wash your hair very well with warm water shampoo twice uh, and then apply conditioner from the middle of your hair to the tips of your hair and then in my case I'm gonna I style my hair with homemade flax seal gel conclusion you should apply the oils on your hair when it's clean. So if you have products on your hair, please rinse it out with warm water. And then when it's dry, when your hair is dry, you can apply the hair treatments on your hair. And ta-da, these are my results. Today is my five day hair. Uh, my hair is feeling soft and the bed that is healthy. I was looking at my at my hair checking if I have split ends and now my hair is pretty healthy and for me that makes me happy because I'm putting effort and love on myself because taking care of my my crown is taking care of myself my temple so do it just be patient be consistent love your hair love yourself you deserve it you deserve to take care of yourself do you deserve love and that love is start from you because if you're not taking care of yourself who gonna do it for you mm? so that's it thank you for watching this video please don't forget to like and subscribe to join me here on youtube i love you all see you next time bye bye Bye.